Good evening, everybody. This is the DCN. I'm here on Bottom Farm Road with the elder Johnny Atkinson with the site, the New Mount Olive Primitive Baptist Church. We'll be having a dedication service on next Saturday, September the 10th at 1 o'clock p.m. Everyone is invited. At this time, you will hear from Elder Donnie Atkinson. Good evening, everybody. This is Elder Donnie Atkinson here, standing here in front of the church, on the New Mount Olive Primitive Baptist Church. I would just want to thank God for how he has blessed us to come this far. We've been working on this church for seven years. Now we are finished with the church. It's not, it's, it's, it says future site. Now it is the site today. Uh, we're going to be in here, the Lord willing, next Saturday at 1 o'clock. All you all from north, south, east, and west, wherever you be, may be at, you may come and, and help us celebrate uh, the, uh, the church the Lord has blessed us with. He has been good to us all seven years. We've been through some struggles and all through the way, but the Lord still brought us. We want to let you know the church will be open every Sunday. So I'm not here. Somebody will be carrying on this church because it's not going to sit here just look. White. We're going to come here. It's going to be here for service every Sunday. Please, ma'am, please, sir, wherever you may be, you want a church home, you want to come uh, wash over for us, that those are uh, welcome for anybody that wants to come and serve with us. Because God is a good God. He's the author of the finish of all faith. He told us to go out in the head of the highway and tell them to come. So I'm telling you today, come to the house of God. Because time is winding up. God is about to come. Come while your blood still running warm in your vein. Come while you're able, because Jesus is on his way back. All right. Uh, you're hearing from the Ever Dunny Atkinson. We on Battle Farm Road. Uh, 3026 Battle Farm Road, Pine Tops, North Carolina. Uh, nice facility. And you need to come out on next Saturday, September the 10th, at 1 o'clock p.m and um, help out with this great facility. Like you said, it was a struggle to get where he is, but now he's here, so the community needs to come out and support this facility. He said it will be open to everyone, all the Primitive Baptists, it's gonna be open to everyone. Um, I'm gonna put him on the spot. Man, I know I, I know you got a little message. I, I ain't heard you preach in a long time. I, I know you can come up with something. I know you. Oh, no. So give us a little piece of something. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. We thank God for being here like well, just a song. I mean, I, uh, I, I just want to let you know that, you know, it's all about the word. It ain't about me, it ain't about you. It's about God's word. He tell us on the journey, you know, because we're going through a lot of things in life. And people are struggling from all different kind of situations. But I want to tell you today, if you just take the book, uh, uh, St. John, about the 14th chapter, St. John, it reads just like him. He said, let not your heart be troubled. He said, if you believe in God, he said, believe also in me. He said, in my father's house are many mansions. And he said, were not so, I wouldn't have told you. He said, I'm going away. Now, if I go away, I'm going to pray a play for you. If I go and pray a play for you, I'm coming back again. And I said, I'm going to see you under myself. He said, where I am, that you may be also. No Thomas want to know something. He said, Lord, how can we know whether thou goes and how can we know the way? And Jesus said, I am the way. He said, I am the truth and the life. He said, no man come unto the Father, but but by me. Fill us the Lord. Lord, show us the Father. And Jesus said, so long time have I been with you as show us the Father. Said Philip, said the Father and me, and I'm in the Father. Said me and my Father, we are one. When he said, the work I do, not do it not myself, but he uh, that dwells in me, he does the work. So God does the work. So what anything you're going through, just call on God. Any kind of trouble you got, he said, let not your heart be troubled. Say, believe in him. He said, all things will come to pass. He will let you know that he'll be with you on all kind of situations. But you got to put God first. Put God first and talk to him all the time. Because it's a praying time. It's a time for not put up all the foolishness and call on the Lord. And let tell God all about what you're going on, which he already know. But you got to do something for yourself. Let not 
out your heart be troubled today. Believe in God. He said, believe also in me. Because in his father's house, there are men and men. We need to come to the house of God. When we open up this church, I want to see it overflow this community. And come on here to support this church. You'll see what the Lord can do for you. It's a blessing right here at this church. All you got to do is come in and get some word. And the word will set you free. God is a good God. He's a mighty God. He's a T-man, baby. He's the holy one for my Peter Ram. He said he was the first and the last. The beginning and the end. He said, in the church, he is the offspring of David and the brighter than the morning star. I'm not going to get too far out here because I am the white horse rider. Every now and then, he'll let me ride it. But I'm not going to ride him today, but I feel good about it because he is my Lord and all. God bless you and heaven do smile on you. Yeah, I got to have a little song to go with that. A piece of song. <laughs> I'm about the songs. I love <laughs> uh, Let me see here now. Uh. Then a song was trying to yeah, sing. I'm putting them on the spot because I passed by um, um, when I was coming in this evening. I stopped and took some pictures of the of the facility, and I also uh, called them and told them come on home, come on out, and uh, let me do a live this afternoon and help the brother out uh, with his dedication service. I plan to be here. I got another engagement, but I already spoke to them. I plan on um, coming by here and staying for. I hope I better stay for one to three. Because my other engagement is right down the road. So I'm looking forward to next Saturday. So uh, let the brother give us a little piece of song. Because I, I, I know um, when I asked him about give us a little sermon, I know he could do it. Because I know him, been knowing him for, for, for a long time. And he's always ready. The White Horse Rally. So let's give a piece of song and then we're going to move on out of the way. We're going to try to sing a hymn. The Lord give me a, as I age of 19, about 40 some years ago. He's finally in there. In a, in a, in, a, in a hymn book, a little small black hymn book, uh, called Front I Stand on Zion Hill and View My Star Will Cry. Friendly, I stand on Zion Hill and View My Star. With a crown, no power on earth, my hope can shake, nor hell can pull me down. I know power on earth, my hope can shake, nor hell can pull me down. Nor hell can pull me down. No hell can pull me down. No power on earth. My hope can shake. No hell can pull me down the lofty the hills and stay the top that lift thy head on high on the long hill and stay the top that lift thy head Oh, I shall all be liver in the dust. Thy very name shall die. I shall all be liver in the dust. Thy very name shall die. All right. The elder done it. Here at the uh, New Mount Olive Primitive Baptist Church and the Living Hope Primitive Baptist Church and of the New Bethlehem Association. Yeah, the Dunning Atkinson Pastor of Pine Top, North Carolina. I appreciate you. I um, you know I caught you off guard, but uh, I wanted to do a little something. But now I'm going to walk out in front of the church and let you see what it looked like on the outside. And, uh,
have become Lady Three. Lady Three on the inside look like. I don't know what Lady Three is. You come on down next Saturday, uh, September the tenth, one o'clock p.m. And you can see what the inside looks like, and do some more good preaching mm-hmm. and singing. Again, September the tenth, one o'clock p.m. Bonner Farm Road, 3026, the new Mount Olive from the Baptist Church. This was the Elder Johnny Addison on a Saturday evening. And he's always ready. Called the brother up from the New Church, came on down, uh, gave us a little message and a little singing. Mm-hmm. Appreciate you, my brother. Look forward to next Saturday. Thank you. God bless you. Have a good evening.